Hello and welcome to a brand new series. This is Cricket Captain 2020 and this is the road to world number one with England now. We are restarting the series because um, I, I'm on a new computer. I don't have the old save file anymore. Um, and I thought it makes sense to just, you know, start again with it and uh, and, and run with it really so uh yeah i'm joe if you're new around here and this is going to be uh, the pilot episode of this series um we're gonna just be doing the, the 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 test matches in this series i think that's the one that we all enjoy the most and uh and that's um the one that i think is the most important really uh the test match uh championship and and trying to win that so um if you want to see more episodes of cricket captain make sure you leave a big thumbs up down below i know lots of people have been requesting it on the channel uh to return and uh, that's exactly what i'm doing so starting again with the road to world number one and hopefully it'll go a little bit better this time so uh today we've got the first test match against the west indies so let's have a little look at the squad that i have picked so this is the 13 man squad that we've got we'll just have a little look at the condition so it's looking like it's going to be a batsman's pitch so we we certainly don't want to be um going for this many bowlers in my opinion uh i think maybe mark wood can come out for for Chris Walks, um, yeah, and just move him up the order a little bit. Um, he's going to be the opening bowler. We got Jofra in there as well. Um, yeah, that looks that looks a lot better to me. So Burns and Sibley opening the batting, and then we got Zach Crawley at three, Joe Root at four, Bairstow at five, Butler six. He's going to be our keeper. Uh, Stokes at 7, Walks at 8, Archer 9, Broad 10 and uh, Jimmy Anderson at number 11. So let's get into the match then. Let's see how we get on. Um, we've won the toss and of course we are going to bat first and try and get plenty of runs on the scoreboard. So here we go then. Let's see how we get on in beautiful crisp 4K for this game. So without further ado, let's get into the action. Yeah, that's a good shot. Just helped it to the boundary for four. Yeah, that's fairly loud. Fairly loud. Um, let's just try and turn that down a bit. Okay. Right. Let's keep going then. That's a lot better for me. Good Hopefully, it there. is for you as well. And that's four runs for Sibley. And uh, Sibley was awesome in the other save that we had. He became probably one of the best openers in the world. Um, so I'm hoping that we can see something similar from him. That's an excellent Four shot. Run. Four runs for Dom Sibley. Ooh, that could be a thin edge. Not out. Not out. And of course, this game has uh, been updated as recently as February. Um, and of course, there will probably be um, another Critic Captain game coming out in, in May, June. Well, he's really picked that one out. That sort of period. Well, that's an excellent shot from Rory Burns. What was the batsman thinking of? Well, lunch of a long day one. Only 63 without loss. You know, that's a, kind of the problem we're having two fairly defensive Not out, but it looked plum. A fairly defensive uh, opening batsman. Oh, that's a cracker though from Dom Sibley. There's another one. Great ball, but the batsman survives. But that's fifty. For Dom Sibley. Well, he's battled through to fifty. I think we can be very, very pleased with that. Good start to the summer for him. That's a massive shout for LBW, but the umpire says not out. It would be nice if we can get fifty for Rory Burns there as well. The hundreds up. Yeah, good shot. He's timed that beautifully. So he moves into the 40s now. 
What a shot. Oh, that's over the top, and that's four runs. Brilliant. And there's 50 for Rory Burns. Well taken single. So what an opening partnership this has been. He's really picked that one out. And this is exactly what we needed to do. Lovely shot from Rory Burns. Starting to really play his strokes. Lovely. And there's another one. 10 off the over so far. Make that 14. Brilliant. Rory Burns moves into the 70s now. He's really started to pick up in confidence. Yeah, Sibley as well. This is good stuff. What a great start for us. Great but Rory Burns has gone. The first wicket of the summer. 154 opening partnership, but Burns has gone for 72. And uh, it's 154 for one, but that could be out as well from Zach Crawley, and it is. A little feather there, he's gone for one. That's not a good start for him. He's edged it. Well, Sibley needs to stick about. Joe Root, of course, needs to stick about. Wow. That should have been... Very, very close, and it was, but just outside the line of off stump. And T interval on day two, 167 for two. Good shot from Joe Root. Nice on drive, and if he can get a good score today, get his summer off to a good start, that would be fantastic. Another boundary for Dom Sibley, and he looks like he is going to be. Oh, no, I've jinxed him. I've jinxed him. He's gone for 94. What a shame. Well, oh, what a pity. Johnny Bairstow now comes to the crease. Uh, he's had a rotten series in Fine India shot. most recently. Uh, certainly in the test test matches anyway. Well bowled. But we're three down now after being 154 without loss. So, it's, you know, not be... Not be resting on our laurels here. Fine shot. Yeah, good shot. Trademark off drive. Two hundred, very much up here. Oh, but what a ball! And Bear still gone for twenty-one. And we're now four down. Josh Butler comes to the crease, and he's now going to start. Hopefully, being the aggressor. Of course, we've got Ben Stokes to come as well. That could be out, and it is. Butler gone for five. So Ben Stokes here, a lot sooner than I wanted. And if we don't get 350 400 here that'll be a big disappointment after the start that we made but joe root's going along nicely just needs uh ben stokes to go along with him oh and he's gone he's out for 14 so chris walks comes to the crease now end of day one two six seven for six good recovery after um a fairly slow start to the day Oh, Root's gone. Well, he's out for 46. So Joffre Archer comes to the the crease now. And we're going to be lucky to get 300. Which is ridiculous, really. Poor old bowler. He's gone for four more. That was a horrible shot. Come on. That one moved. Oh. Oh, that's high in the air. It's going to be six. What a shot from Jofra Archer. Hooked for six. Oh, but he's gone. 297 for for eight now. A big appeal. Well, that must have been close, but the umpire says not out. Well, let's have a look at that. Struck just outside the line, apparently. Good shot from Stuart Broad. Four runs. Right off the middle. And again. So the three hundreds up. They're appealing. The no. Says not out. I think that was outside the line again. Bold. What an absolute cracker of a That's out. Stu Broad gone for fourteen, three seventeen for nine now. Oh what a shot! That's the cool. Burnley Lara. Off and running again. That's hit him and oh really no. no, 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 no. Oh heading. no. Well, he's retired hurts. So that means he can't bowl. 
and he can't bat in the second inning. So we're all out for 3.23. Wow, what a pity. So James Anderson and Stuart Broad um, will be opening the ball in for us. Anderson to Braithwaite. First ball, and that's got to be out. Yes, it is. Anderson gets the first wicket. Braithwaite's gone. And uh, he's out for a duck and with the very first ball of uh, Jimmy Anderson's summer. And well, while that gets our hopes up a little bit, Anderson now straight into Campbell. No. Not quite. That beat the bat all ends up. Well, this is a good spell from Jimmy. Jimmy now to Brooks. Edged and gone. Great catch from Joe Root, I'm presuming. Yep, yeah, he's gone for eight. And now West Indies 28 for two. So Jeffrey's uh, been tight. Brought in. That's high in the air. And it's caught. Campbell gone for 31. So an excellent wicket for Stuart Broad. Broad now into Blackwood. Not out. And the umpire gives the bowler a curious look. Not quite that time. So Anderson for Ben Stokes now. Brought in. Soundly beaten, but is it out? Not out. And there's no point in glaring at the batsman. And of course, we don't really have a spinner. Of course, Joe Root is there, but Blackwood's gone. And uh, Broad with his second wicket now. 99 for four. Team will day two. So they're four down here. Let's get Anderson back into the attack with Archer. Just after T. Anderson in. Ooh. Anderson into Dorich. No. No, not quite happening. So Joe Root's going to come in now with Stu Broad at the other end. We'll see how Root gets on. Where well, he's gone. Dorich out for 65. Good ball from Joe Root. Five down now. And Stokes, I guess. To round off the day. End of day two. 204 for five. They're only 119 behind. So this has been a good innings from the Windies. So Anderson and Broad to open up day three. So close to finding the edge. Brought in a shy hope. Edged and gone. Good catch. Bairstow catches him. Hope gone for 58. And now they're six down. And we've exposed the tail because uh, Chase has gone now and brought on four wickets. Anderson coming in to Kemar Roach. It. It, oh. it was an excellent ball, but dropped by Joe Root, unfortunately. Brought in a holder now. He's gone. Five wicket haul for Stuart Broad. Jason Holder gone for 14. And the West Indies 242 for eight. And it's an in now. Sorry, Joseph. He's gone as well. He's out for one. Anderson with his third wicket of the innings. And we do have the new ball available. Stuart Broad needs to be rested. Um, let's get Stokes and Archer in. Archer into Roach. Well, that's not far away. Quite. Go a bit full out of these two. Stokes into Roach. Oof. That was close. Edged and gone. Archer gets his first wicket. Phillip gone for nine. And uh, West Indies 271 all out. Meaning that we have a first innings lead of 52. And I think we can be pretty pleased with that actually. Um, you know, on lunch interval on day three. We're in a, a, a very strong position. And if we can have a, a similar opening partnership to what we had... In the first innings, I think, you know, we're, we're going to head towards victory in this match. Good start for Dom Sibley, of course. Oh, shot from Rory Burns as well. Would be nice if uh, somebody could go on and make a, a big turn. He's edged it. Yeah, shot from Rory Burns. Beautiful on drive there. He felt for that one. It struck him in line. That's gone straight through him. Oh, a blinding shot. 
Four runs, don't bother running. Cracking shot for four. Well, this is very, very good. T interval day three, 75 without loss. Hopefully we can see out the day here. Certainly looking that way. And it looks like it's going to be another 100 partnership. And there it is. So great opening partnership uh, in both innings to open up the summer. And there's 50 again for Dom Sibley. Very, very good start for him. And that's four buys. Oh, and again. Wow. Wow, well, Dorich. Missing a few there, but what a square cut that is from Sibley. Brilliant stuff. And there's the run for Rory Burns. So he gets his 50 as well. So second 50 of the summer for him. And uh, this has just been absolutely sublime. It really has been. So end of day three, 143 without loss. We are 195 runs in the lead. Miles away from the ball that time. So we need to, Good ball. We had to make sure that we're back on it early on today. Well, had no chance. We need to build up a lead strong enough to hold on to. Good cricket. So managing to... Well, a mediocre fielding there. Better the partnership from the first innings and, you know, heading towards 200 here. Heading towards a wonderful 200 partnership. Oh, beautiful leg glance. That's four runs for Dom Sibley. Oh, swept away. Four runs. And that's four all the way. Brilliant. And he's on 98 now. Oh, oh but what a ball. Well, what a shame. Rory Burns gone in the 70s again. And yeah, I'm going to bring in Johnny Bairstow now at number three. I think being a little bit more aggressive is has got to be a good thing. And there's Dom Sibley's sentry. Absolutely brilliant. And that's a, a sentry for him. Another beautiful four there from Johnny Bairstow. This has been absolutely terrific so far. Well hit. And there's another four. So getting towards the 300 lead. Should be a very, very tough chase at this point. There's six. And he struck a huge blow. Six runs. We need Johnny Bairstow to be playing a ODI st style innings. Well, there's the 300 lead coming up. Oh, that's out though. Dom Sibley gone. He's out for 115. I'm going to get Ben Stokes into the middle out there and yeah, give these two. The rule of the roost. Oh, what a shot. So, 308 in the lead. He's backed up and hammered that one. If you bowl it there, he'll smack it to the boundary all day. So, need to try and get this to 350 and then I think declare. Give ourselves almost four sessions to complete this in. That's 50 for Johnny Bairstow. And that's his half century. Good linens from him. Not quite. Ah, oh, best all gone. So Butler is going to come in. That's our last real aggressive batsman. Yeah, four runs there. I'm not getting awards that. Hold of that. We're not getting awards that 350 mark just yet. Oh, what a shot. Four more. So we're 300 up now. So 
I think we're going to declare there. It's a bit risky because it's still very much winnable for the West Indies. They need 352 to win. But you'd fancy that we've just about got enough to defend this and plenty of time to get the 10 wickets. So here we go. Um, we're going to, of course, have Stu Broad opening with James Anderson. Um, these two were the, the highlight of the first innings. We very much need them to get a breakthrough tonight. Otherwise, we will feel like it's possible for the Windies. I think that's going to miss leg stump. And it would have missed leg stump. Mm -hmm. So, certainly an interesting start here. Stokes to Brathwaite. What a ball that is. And Brathwaite gone for 23. Stokes to Brooks now. Oh, well, Stokes. Yes, Campbell gone as well. Ben Stokes, one over that was. Archer now to Brooks. That could be gone. And it is. He's gone for one. What a spell of ball and this is from both of them. Good little partnership that we've cooked up here just towards the end of the day. Two overs left and there you go. End of day four then. 107 for three. So they just need 245 to win. Anderson, first over. That could be gone. And it is. Blackwood gone. Fourth ball of the day. And now, surely, it's too much to ask for the West Indies to get back into this. And Stuart Broad gets a wicket as well. 107 for five now, and surely they're just going to run ragged. Broad to Hope. It, oh, well, Joe Root drops it again. We'll have to get him on catch and practice in the training session. Anderson to chase. White, but surely. Archer to chase. What a ball. Chase gone. He's out for 18. Archer with his second wicket of the match. And what can Ben Stokes do as well? Archer to holder. He's gone. He's out for nine. Three wickets to, to win now. And with two sessions to go, you fancy that we're going to do it. Stokes to Roach. Not quite. Lunch interval, day five, then 160 for seven, so still 192 to win. Oh, that's gone. Roach out for six. And Joseph gone as well. Five wickets for Jofra Archer. Can he get his sixth? Yes, he can. And that is the end of the match. Shy Hope gone for 20. Joffre Archer, what a brilliant uh, demolition job, really, of the, the lower order of the West Indies there. Five wickets, uh, the well, the final five wickets, and the earlier wicket of Brooks as well. We win by 190 runs in our first match of the summer. Dom Sibley gets man of the match, I think deservedly so. Unlucky not to get two centuries. Rory Burns, 72 and 76, very, very strong as well. Um, and, you know, a, an excellent start of the summer. That's exactly what we wanted. We wanted to beat West Indies, beat them well. Um, Chris Walks is out for, for three weeks, which is a bit of a shame. Um, but, no, we should be really, really happy with that. So, if you've enjoyed this first episode, remember, it's a pilot episode. Depending on how well it does, um, we'll, depend, we'll, you know, decide whether this becomes a full series again uh before we get on to critic captain 2021 so make sure you hit the thumbs up button down below it'd be great to hit 50 for this first part subscribe for more critic content in the future and i hope you guys are having a wonderful day thanks for watching and goodbye